Okay, I was distracted during the ban phase. I accidentally didn't get one ban since you have so little time now. Also, they banned Poseidon and Hebo, Boxer, Uller, Scotty. They banned all the guys I want to ban, so we're, we're in the clear anyways. I accidentally banned Vamana, apparently, uh, while I was alt-typing trying to get the video rendered. Uh, did not realize I banned Vamana. Okay, well, maybe that'll throw them off on what god I'm playing when I choose Sobek. You're all right, mate. You're all right, mate. Let's use, okay, look, we have to use Pirate Skin. Okay, it's Amazon Cub. It's nerfed, Amazon Cub. We got this, okay? I did not ban out Amazon Cub. I could have, but he's nerfed. We'll be fine. Look, apparently Amazon Cub is the only OP god I can beat. So let's see. <laughs> All right. Warrior's Blessing into, do I want to go bankrupt? What if I go Book of Thoth? I think we might have to go for, like, a really weird power poly build. We might have to go to the librarian build. Librarian build is every single book. <laughs> so librarian build, here we come. Okay. I'm also going to get a do I want a bracer? Yeah, it'll help us in the early game. It, he'll get anti-heal, which sucks, but it, it'll help the early game quite a bit. Okay. So back you got this, okay? Got this. Remember your training. Remember them jukes. This guy doesn't know what's gonna hit him. Ahoy! Enemies off to starboard bow! This is the best Sobek skin. This is our game to win. Okay? Just gotta focus. And he already cleared wave. Okay. <laughs> oh my god, I'm a Zenkov. Stop. 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 Leave me alone. Alright, I only took three fourths of my health. I'm trying to clear the wave. That's fine. I didn't even get the wave. That's the best part. Okay. Good damage. He has Bracer too, by the way. Ooh, if I could get a nice level 4 here, that would be a big play. But I'm not going to hit level 4, unfortunately. Okay. I almost am about to hit level 4. Please give me level 4. I need it to pluck him. Okay. Now I have level 4, but now he's not low enough. Come on. Nope. I'm so dead. Nope. I am so, so dead. Unless he doesn't kill me. I'm gonna back. I missed like two waves in total, probably. This is like as... No, it's not. I'm only 100 gold behind. 150. That's not too bad. It's better than being first-blooded, I guess. In terms of XP, I'm pretty far behind. We're going Book of Thoth. I haven't gotten Book of Thoth on a Guardian in so long. Because it'll give us hope late game. That's mainly why. Book of Thoth gives so much power. If you build with it late game. Like if I go Breastplate. If I go uh, maybe Book of the Dead. I go Soul Reaver. You know. It's going to give tons of power. 9% of all items that give me mana. So if an item gives me 300... It'll give me 27 power. Is that right? Your tower Please don't attack. steal this buff. Okay, you just want the tower. Fair enough. Okay. Nice thing on Sobek is my ult gives me mana back. So, if I'm almost out of mana, I can pop my ult and stay in the fight. Which is good. Which is really good. Oh, I missed. I rarely miss my plucks. But I just missed it. So, that's tough. Okay. Oh, also, I wanted to bring this up for YouTube. I have been starting to play Dead by Daylight, and that is such a fun game. And I've been I've been wondering if you guys would be interested in some Dead by Daylight content. You need to let me know. I'm probably going to do it either way, but if you guys build hype for it, I'll be more excited to edit. Hey, first blood. Well, you know, wasn't even paying attention, Amazon Cup. Yeah, but so let me let me know if you guys are fans of Dead by Daylight. It's a game. Here's the here's the basis of the game. 
you, there is four survivors and one killer. And the killer is... This is going to be such a bad summary. Is pretty much being controlled by, the, by a thing called the Entity. In order to please the Entity, the killer has to sacrifice all four survivors. Now, the Entity feeds off of hope. So it gives the survivors hopes in terms of if they complete... If they repair five generators and open a, a gate to escape, they can get out and save themselves. And if there's only one survivor left then he can escape through what's called the hatch and the killer in order to kill someone has to hook a survivor three times the first hooks they just wait there you know just hanging and a, another survivor has to unhook them in the second state they have to struggle so they have to spash, spam their space bar struggling for their life against the entity otherwise they get sacrificed and third state they just die and if you're too long on a hook, you advance to the next one. So that's all I'll talk about Dead by Daylight, since this is a Dead by Daylight video. This is, is Tobek versus Amazenka. But just want to let you guys know that I might make some videos on that. It's been super fun. Okay. Can we kill him? Nope. I wish I could apply my three there. Some anti-heal would have been very nice. I'm glad I held on to my bracer there. Otherwise, I would have died. Okay, we have a snowball. Snowball is good. Now, important that we don't die, otherwise he's going to be more ahead than we are. Because that's how duel works. Also, I need to get my stacks. Okay. They would be edited videos also, by the way. And a Kepri video I'm working on. I'm about halfway done. I thought I would have it finished by now, but it's got to be good. <laughs> It's, it's pretty close to being done. I think you guys will like it. Okay, pull him into tower. CC him, keep him in. Oh, now I might be dead. That's my bad. Shouldn't have gone for it when I was that low health. I thought maybe I could have killed him. Since he, you know, doesn't have any defense or just tier 1 boots. But he has mobility with his hives. That's fine. That's fine. The important thing is we got our, uh, our boots online. And our Book of Thoth. That's the hardest thing, getting Book of Thoth online. We have 20 stacks on it, which is not bad. It starts off at 6%. That's good. Like, we have a lot of power right now. How much uh, mana does Bancrofts give? Bancrofts gives 150. That would only give, like, 13 power from Book of Thoth. So, it'd mainly be the base... The base power for Bancrofts if I do get that. You have Bracer? Oh, I don't have Bracer when I thought I did. Oh no, I thought I had Bracer. I don't know why, but sometimes when I glance at my relic, I just, it looks like it's up when that was clearly not up. I'm throwing, I'm throwing, I'm throwing, I'm doing exactly what I said I wasn't going to do. My ult does nothing right now, too. Sobek ult does not do much until late game. Oh, I cannot lose this. We need to get past Sobek. If we get past Sobek, it's a, it's, this is the home stretch, okay? Sobek is like... Sobek and maybe Xingtian. Sylvanas is difficult, but I'm so practiced with him. I feel like I can get a win. Come on, Sobek, remember your training. Your training. Get them last hits. Okay, you didn't get the last hits. That's fine. Oh. This is fine. This is fine. Get out of the slow. I took half my health. More than half my health. Stop. Are you serious? Get out of the slow. No! That slow is so strong. Why does Amazenkov get so much base movement speed with his one? Maybe I should have gotten speedy boots, but these boots give mana. Your under this sucks. Your tower has been destroyed. Okay. Alright. Too bad Transcendence doesn't work like Book of Thoth, where you have to actually build with it. Bancrofts probably would have helped me out more by now, but at the same time, if I had Bancrofts, he would have probably went anti-heal, you know? Or would have would go anti-heal a lot faster. There's not even a tower for me to hide behind now. My 
heal's okay. It's okay. Sobek's shield's kind of garbage. I should probably get a healing chalice, but I just need I need to get my items online. Okay, let's look at the mana items. Book of the Dead could be decent. When you have like full poly. Poly gives what 300 mana? Yeah. Poly's where it's at right now. Well not now, but soon. You got executioner online already? How? Like how is that possible? Alright. I can't go in I can't go breastplate. I need a man. I need a man. Alright, come on, come on, come on, come on. I don't wanna lose this easily. I've had comeback games from worse. My biggest comeback games have been like from four thousand, five thousand gold behind. We are only 1,400 right now. We can do this. He doesn't have defense. Hope is still in the balance. Uh, and I missed. Okay. I said my bracer. This should be a decent fight. Oh, it's not a decent fight. It is. Okay. I did not think my ultimate would do that much, but he doesn't have defense. So it makes sense. And this is what I always imagine when my opponents don't go defense right away. They probably do it to give me a chance because I'm a guardian, right? But then once I kill them, they realize that they can't give me a chance and they get rid of, they get defense again. Which kind of entirely defeats the purpose of giving someone a chance if you take if you go back on it. But oh well. Okay. Okay, these are all down, just getting timers. Alright. I can go double defense. It would actually be decent here. Or I could build into Bancroft since... <sighs> I, need, I need pans. Alright. Thorns. Okay. Alright. If that's a Pestilence, I don't go Bancroft. If that's not a Pestilence, maybe I go Bancroft. It's still a good thing that we got Book of Filth early though. Because now we almost have it stacked. Once we have it stacked, we're going to get a huge power spike. If I go Typhoons. Ooh, I almost have my ult. Oh, I really want to keep him here. Oh, I missed! Oh, he missed! Thank God! No! I should have popped out earlier. If you cancel Sobek ult early, it reduces the damage by quite a bit. Even if it's like half a second. Oh no. I'll add, wait, Sobek gains protection as ultimate? 30%? I knew he gained some, but I didn't know it was percent based. 40% maxed? Ooh, what about Pridwin? What about Pridwin? You know what? Let's do some theory crafting gamers. If I go Pridwin, does that give mana? No, it gives cooldown reduction, which I need. When you, you're all t that also will give me protections against his thorns because it gives physical and magic protections. Huh. Equal to your protection. So if I had, well, he has executioner, so that'll just reduce my protections. Never mind. I just realized that things like executioner and stuff will counter. Pridwin. People realize that, right? In Conquest, I'm sure they realize that. Because you just lower their protections by so much, their shield would be nothing. Alright, he did go Bulwark, so we can go Bancroft's. Or I can try getting a, a Pest a Poly. No, he's just going to take that. Okay. Okay, keep him in the ult. Keep him in the ultimate. Well, okay, I cleared wave. He probably will take Phoenix off that. Probably will take Phoenix. I need to go double defense. I need double defense. Bancrofts won't save me right now. That'll give me cooldown reduction too. My Nemean did 672 damage there. Nice. That does more than my ultimate. <laughs> or almost as much. 
All right, that's fine. As long as he doesn't get game off that. I'm okay when you know people take my Phoenix and then my Titan. You know that's game. But when people take my Phoenix Tower, Phoenix Titan, in one go, it is pretty upsetting. All right, come on, come on. So back your three levels down. Your Book of Thoth is evolved. You have 400 power. This is not too bad. Too bad my abilities scale like garbage. However, Polly does not scale like garbage. So, another defense item is more important, but you know. Ooh, we got Aussie though. I have anti on my three, but is that enough? I might need to find Ruin. Well, he just forced me to go something I don't want to go. Getting that actually is worth it. Because he can't build it for another couple seconds. Your titan's under attack. Okay. Oh, that's half my titan. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. New titan sucks. What? I left titan for like two seconds. Oh, I hate this new titan so much. Why would they get, make it have no health? Why? I understand why reducing its damage so people can't hide behind it and have titan do all the work for it. Because... Titan sitting was a problem, but if the Titan does no damage, it should at least have some health, so it takes some time to take. My god. Oh, and he left. Oh, no. I hate Sobek. Sobek's so bad. He's so bad. His scaling is so low. He's like Ymir with a bad passive. Like, if Ymir did not have the passive he had, Ymir would not be good in duel. And Sobek's kind of like that. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this video. And make sure to tell me what you guys thought about uh, thought about the Dead by Daylight idea. And yeah, have a good idea. Have a good what? Have a good day. <laughs>